Guys, you have to make a donut. Try to make it nice and delicious. Wow, a donut. But they're round. That's right, Quentin. That's why I have as the main one for round food. The best donuts of all will turn out because only mine will be round. Now we will need the dough for donuts. Let's mix everything. And ready! Wow, what a cool dough came out! And you need to mold them into a round shape and put them on the baking sheet. Perfect! I'm just gonna make holes like that. Great! And what about the others? I'm doing great! I've already made the dough. Now I need to put it in the mold. But a round one doesn't suit me at all. A square one will be just right. With the help of Lego, I will assemble a mold for myself. You just need to remember the skills of a professional Lego collector. This should be here, and this is here. Oh, where are you going? Oh, we'll find it now. Yeah, perfect square mold for donuts. Now we can pour the dough. Ready, let's go to the oven. Wow, Quentin's square donut looks cool. But my round ones will be better. I will fry my donuts in oil as the classic recipe. Excellent! We put the finished donuts on a plate and decorate everything with pink glaze. And now, the most important part. Colored sprinkles. Whoa, how beautiful it turned out! We need to add a couple of chocolate butterflies for more cuteness. Amazing! Hey, Miley! Rate my donut! Cool, right? And it smells just awesome! It is necessary to pull out of the mold rather than start decorating right away. Why isn't it coming off? Well, that's okay. I have a mold made from Lego. I'm just gonna disassemble it. Perfect! Ah, so hot! Ah! Uh-oh. Catching, catching! Perfect! Right in the aim. Look! I have a glaze made from Nutella and popcorn. Ooh, so amazing. But that's not it. Hmm, I want to add some more toppings. Some strawberry jam inside. And look, it even gets bigger! Cool! Ah, uh, how hard it is to knead dough for donuts! Yeah, I need to catch up a little bit. I want to make the dough brighter, and I'll add some dye. Beautiful! Cool! Hmm, triangle. I know! If you combine two shapes, you get one great for a triangle donut! Put the forms on the baking sheet and pour the dough. Done! Now we carefully put rubber gloves on my hands. You know why? Because we're gonna add a little electricity. This way my donut will cook faster. Oh, hot! Ooh. That was cool. My triangular donut is done. The only thing left is to pour sweet syrup with chocolate. And add chocolate lightning. It is so reminiscent of the sun caution electricity, right? Chef, the little cooks have everything ready. They want to present them to you. Whoa, all these donuts look really great. I'll start with this one, the classic donut. Mmm, chocolate butterfly, yummy. Whoa, and the donut itself is just amazing. What's next? Hmm, I haven't eaten square donuts yet. So, let's try. Ooh, even strawberry jam inside. I like it. Ooh, goodies. Why is the donut charged with the electricity? Ah, what is this? <sighs> The winner is the square one. Really? Seriously? Thank you, I won! 
Hmm, what should I choose? Oh, I want you to make pizza. Remember the recipe? Then let's go cook. Uh, square pizza? Okay. Let's start with the flour. Let's pour some in the form of a mountain. Make a slide and a dimple. Add an egg and mix everything. Yeah, the dye is awesome. Whoa, Miley, you've already made the dot too? Can I roll out your rolling pin? Huh, Quentin, the rolling pin will make the dot round, and now you need a square one. Okay, I have my own cool square rolling pin. You'll envy me. Damn, it's not a convenient one to roll. Well, that's fine. Now I need to make the sides. Add some tomato paste. And some cheese. Square ham will not be superfluous. Now, we send it to the oven. I'll be baking my pizza very soon too. My round pizza will be the most perfect of all. I'll just need to add some more cheese. Mushrooms. Just like that. Sweet peppers. And of course, tomatoes. And don't forget about round ham. Great. Now we need to cut it in the middle. In the triangles. And roll them. Oh, it is so perfect. Looks like a sun. We'll go to the oven. What? Where are you going? Bake already? Damn, the guys are overtaking me again. Ooh, that's right. Why don't I use the recipe book from the chef? Now I'll find out how to make a triangular pizza. Hmm, not this one. Beautiful, but not what I need. Oh, seriously? There is no triangular pizza here? Oh, that's right. Here is it. The mold for the triangular pizza. Perfect! Now I can pour the dough inside. Now we need to prepare everything for the filling. I definitely need a couple of slices of ham. Oh, a lot of cheese. And… Red pepper will definitely not be superfluous. I love everything spicy. Great! Now I can pour all the filling on the dough into the mold. Let's start with cheese. Some sausages. And a little hot pepper. Fill everything with the remains of the dough. And fry. I don't like waiting, so that's why I'm gonna eat my Iron Man glove. Great! It's ready. Ooh. I'm gonna need to put out the mold. Whoa! Better than I expected. And how can I serve pizza without Coca-Cola? I just need to attach a small cooler to the bottle. And I can put it in the center of the pizza. So that now Chef can taste the pizza and Coca-Cola. I'm such a smart girl. Oh really, Milo? It's a cool idea. Hey, you guys, are you done? Then present the works to me. Come on, come on. Wow, how many interesting pizzas. But I'll start with the square from Quentin. Mmm, good pizza. Nothing extra. Perfect. What do we have here? Hmm, it's definitely not possible to cope without a help of a knife. Now we'll cut off a little piece and evaluate it. The idea with the Coca-Cola is perfect. Ideal combination. Let's try. Hmm, great. Ooh, what's next? 
Triangular pizza? I only know triangular pieces, but not a whole pizza. Interesting taste. Hmm, I don't understand what's inside. Oh no. Is it a hot pepper? Ah! I definitely need some Coke! <sighs> it's like there's a flame in my mouth. Goodies. This Coca-Cola saved me. That's why Miley's winning this time. What? Seriously? I don't believe my ears and eyes! I won! Have you heard it? I won! What else do we have here? Oh, right. Guys, you have scrambled eggs for the next round. Scrambled eggs? Well, that's interesting. Ooh, I already have an idea. I use my favorite bread. It is perfect for a square-shaped scrambled eggs. Let's cut out the inside of the bread. And then I'm gonna take a frying pan and pour some oil. Let's put my piece. And inside, I'm just gonna beat an egg. Oops, a little shell got caught. Ugh. Uh, I can pull out, it's too hot. Haha, <laughs> Quentin, you're so funny. Now I'll show you how professionals make round scrambled eggs. But for that one, I'm gonna need some marshmallows. We spread marshmallows around them and put it in the microwave. Let's put the timer on and wait. Well, there's a little time to have a snack now. Mmm, so good. I'm gonna need some yellow ones. I'm gonna put them in the little bowl. Marshmallow is ready. That's why now I can put some M&Ms inside to make it like a yolk. Great. Quentin, is that smell coming from you? Uh, I think you have a problem. Uh, no, no, I'm fine. Uh, everything under control. Uh, why is it not sticking out? Come on, fall. Ah, so hot. Okay, let's use a little shovel. Oh, yeah, definitely something went wrong. We need to fix it somehow. Ooh, right. The chef always said that beautiful greenery fixes everything. Yeah, it looks better, right? Look. No, not so bad. Hmm, how would I make my triangle scrambled eggs? Oh, that's right. A brilliant idea came to me. I need to separate the yolk and the white. Just like this. And now we make a lot of small triangular shapes out of foil. So cute! Now, pour the yolk into one of the molds. And in the other ones, I'm gonna pour the whites. Let's pour the foil. We burn everything a little with a burner. And ready! Whoa! So cute! The only thing left is to put everything beautifully on the plate. Whoa! Damn, I can cook! Tug guy! And where is my favorite scrambled eggs? Oh, that's it. Amazing! It looks not so bad. Hmm, what is this? This one's terrible. How could you serve the chef burnt scrambled eggs? So, what do you have here? Hmm, I'm just gonna try this one. Uh, interesting. I didn't know that eggs can be stringy. But it's not an egg. It's a marshmallow. Strange. Okay, but that's not bad. Original. Hmm, what is this one? I think this ones are my favorite fried eggs. That's right. Mmm, that's what I wanted. Perfect. And so interesting. Okay, Sophie, you win this time. 
What? Really? I can't believe it! Finally! Go ahead and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss the same funny and delicious challenges. See you later!